Alright guys, what's going on? It's your boy TG and today we are back with part three of this franchise mode original six series. Uh if you missed the last one, we did win the Stanley Cup against the Boston Bruins, so we did get a little redemption. And we also got a, a super, superstar player that I want to show you guys. So without further ado, let's go ahead and go to edit lines to see this mysterious player. And the mysterious player is Austin Matthews. Uh, while off this video, I did manage to get him in free agency. Um, so he will be playing on that first line with me and Kaner and Connor Bedard. How, uh, he was a 79 overall when we drafted him. So he has moved up seven overall points, if you want to call it. Uh, he will be playing with William Nylander and Cole Caulfield. We still got Patrice Bergeron, who we stole from the Bruins. Um, so that was kind of why the Bruins had lost. And then we also got Taylor Hall right here. And Evan Rodriguez has moved down to the um, fourth line right there. So this lineup, the offense is just stacked, especially those top two lines. Show you guys defense. Uh, we did take away Matt Grisgood from the Bruins. So he will be playing with Seth Jones. Uh, while Haralik and Emerson will play together. And then it will be uh, Connor Murphy and TJ Brody. Uh, goalies. We got Ilya Samsonov. And we got Jeremy Swayman. So I'm excited for this part three. Hopefully we can win back-to-back -back Stanley Cups. Especially with the new additions of... of edition of Austin Matthews. So without further ado, let's get to Simmons. Alright guys, so we are now 41, 18 and 5 of the season with 87 points in the division. First in our division. Uh off this video I did get Patrick I mean I did get Dylan Larkin from the uh, Red Wings. I traded away Patrice Bergeron because he was getting old. He was 84 overall and he might retire at the end of this season so that's why i just went ahead and traded him away uh show you guys the leading uh point score and that is patrick kane with 80 points in 64 games so let's go kaner uh if i do decide to make some more trades i'll tell you guys and if not just keep on rolling make it to the playoffs so let's go all right, guys, so we are now 52, 24 and 6 of the year with 110 points in our division. Uh, off this video, I did get Michael Bunting. So, uh, welcome to the team, Michael Bunting. Show you guys the leading point score, and that is Austin Matthews with 106. I sure hope he wins the Maurice Rocker Richard, uh the first time as the Chicago Blackhawk. Probably show the, probably my jealous least fans, but he did manage to get 106 points. So let's go, Austin Matthews. Um, Patrick Kane got 100. I got 93. Connor Bedard 69. William Nylander 66. Dylan Larkin 63. Michael Bunting 58. Tyler Batuzzi 54. Who we also got. Uh, we brought back Tyler Batuzzi and Cole Caulfield, 51, and so forth. Show you guys the entire league. And Austin Matthews with 106 points. Good enough for the Art Ross. Uh, Kaner with 100. I got 93, so that first line for us just went off. Uh, Mitch Marta with 91. I'm still trying to rob the Maple Leafs. Um, I tried to get Mitch Marta for them, um, but... It didn't work out, so hopefully he beats a free agent like they put Austin Matthews in free agency. Uh, Brad Marchand with 89, David Pasternak with, 80, with 88, sorry, uh, Artemi Panarin with 87, Mika Sabanjad with 76, and Shepard with 73. See who won the Maurice Rock Richard. Please let it be Austin Matthews. And it is, so ha-ha, Leafs fans. Ah, oh, boy, you just love to see it. And I had the most assists in the league, so let's go me. Uh, defenseman, most points, uh, Charlie McAvoy with 69. Rookie skaters, Connor Bedard, let's go. 69 points. 
uh, for most points for Ricky Skater. So hopefully he takes home the Calder uh, this year. And without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and get to the playoffs. So let's go. All right, guys. I'm going to be taking on the Maple Leafs in the playoffs. Honestly, if we don't beat the Maple Leafs after taking away Austin Matthews and William Nylander from them, I'm going to be so upset. I mean, Austin Matthews chose to sign with us because we offered him the max amount of salary, which no other team did that. So if we don't beat the Maple Leafs, we're going to have some issues. But anyway, it's in the first three games. See how we do against the Toronto Maple Leafs. Okay, so we got shut out in uh, game three. We are still up in the series two games to one. Can we beat them in game four? We can. Uh, can we beat them in game five? We can. Let's go. Austin Matthews taking out his former team. Let's go. We were up against the Red Wings in the Stanley Cup Final. Now, I did get Dylan Larkin for them, gave them Patrice Bergeron because he was getting too old for us. So, see what happens here. And we are up in the series three games to none, so let's go. Oh, wait, I almost did game four. Uh, my fault. If we did win game four, and if we did win the Stanley Cup, and if I sent it, uh be so upset because I didn't want to show it to you guys. 1-1. Uh, William Nylander for us, Shepard for them. 5-1, big second period. William Nylander gets his second of the game. And I should mention, too, we did get harmonic from them. I think he was a free agency, so uh, the Red Wings let him rot in free agency. Uh, let's go. That was a big second period right there. Scoring four goals, and they get another one uh, in the third all right, stop right here. Uh, we're going to watch this. Let the computers play it out. We're going to win our second straight Stanley Cup, guys. I feel so bad uh, for T Patrice Bergeron because he's not going to be part of that team. He did win it with us in part two, but won't be able to win it with us in part three. So go ahead, sim, watch this game, see what happens. All right, three, two. One, zero, and the Chicago Blackhawks for the second straight year have won the Stanley Cup. Let's go. Blackhawks, Stanley Cup champions for the second straight year. You love to see. I do feel sorry for Patrice Bergeron because he didn't get a chance to win with us, but he was getting old, so I had to trade him away. He might retire at the end of the season, or most likely to retire at the end of the season. So I just had to trade him away, and instead we got Dylan Larkin. And there's Ilya Samsonov. He did get the Consmite Trophy, so congratulations to him. Very well deserved, so let's go. Now... It's time for the Stanley Cup. Moment that all hockey fans have been waiting for. Let's see. And there's me right there skating over to Gary Bettman, going to get the Stanley Cup with the fireworks showing uh, behind us. And I hoist it up high for the second straight year. And this is my second straight Stanley Cup. It's, ask the team captain of the Chicago Blackhawks. Let's go. Uh, who should I give the cup to next? Let's see. Uh, tough one, but I think I'm going to give it to Dylan Larkin uh, to hoist in front of the Red Wings fans. <laughs> Red Wings fans are going to boo, but I don't care because, you no, know, we just won our second straight Stanley Cup. Red Wings fans wish that this happened in the, that he would hoist in the Red Wings uniform, but that is not the case because I just got him from y'all. So, ha, ha, ha. Oh, boy. And up next, I'm going to give it to Austin Matthews so I can brag to little Maple Leafs fans that are watching this video that Austin Matthews didn't win the Stanley Cup with y'all. He won it with us as a Chicago Blackhawk, baby. <laughs> uh, you Maple Leafs fans don't like this. 
So for you Red Wings fans and Maple Leafs fans, start watching this video. Uh, boy, I bet y'all feeling upset right now. But anyway, I'm going to give this to Patrick Kane. He deserves it. He played for the Blackhawks for a long time. Won three Stanley Cups with them. I feel like he should win and hoist as many Stanley Cups as he can uh, before he uh, retires. And when he does, I'm going to miss him. Of course, I'm going to miss him in real life because uh, I know he's going to retire in real life. He's 30 some years old uh, right now in real life. And he's going to try and give it all last few years. As a Chicago Blackhawks, so, uh, yeah. Anyway, here's the sick animation that was first introduced in part two when we won the Stanley Cup against the Boston Bruins, which that was a little good redemption right there because we did lose to them in our first year, uh, and then we won against them in our second year. So a little redemption right there. There's our names engraved. On the Stanley Cup, so let's go. What a moment right here. You love to see it. So, yeah. All right. I'm just going to go ahead and uh, exit out of this. Wait till this loads. I'm just sim all the way right here. There we go. Second straight Stanley Cup for us. And I believe that's the second straight call the cup for the Rockets, but I really don't care. All I care about is the NHL, not the AHL. Show you guys the awards. There we go. Stanley Cup champion Chicago Blackhawks for the second straight year. So let's go. And we did win the President's Trophy for the second straight year. In Visual Wars, Austin Matthews with the Art Ross. And the Hearts. So let's go. James Norris goes to Adam Fox for the third straight year. Wow. Lady Bean goes to Patrick Kane for the third straight year. Carla goes to Connor Bedard. So let's go. Consmite goes to Ilya Samsonov. Vesson Trophy goes to Jeremy Swayman. William Jennings also goes to Jeremy Swayman. Bill Mastin goes to Norlander. Uh, Jack Adams goes to Canadians head coach. Uh, Frank J. Selke Trophy goes to Austin Matthews. Ted Lindsay Award goes to Austin Matthews. And the Reese Rock Richard goes to Austin Matthews. i uh, show you guys the playoff tree. So as you can see, we did beat the Maple Leafs. We did beat the Red Wings. Red Wings beat the Canadians. And of course, they lost to us. That's going to do it for this video, guys. So if you enjoyed this video, uh, hit it with a like. Hit it with a subscribe button. Stay tuned for part four. And I will see you guys next time.